As the famous expression goes, good things often come in small packages. But in the case of a collection of books at the University of Iowa, great things here come in small, very small packages. Miniature books. Small, intricately detailed works of art that come in different shapes, designs, styles, and of course, sizes. A miniature book is a book that is typically classified as under three inches at the longest side. My name is Margaret Gamm and I am Head of Special Collections at University of Iowa Libraries. We have over 4,000 miniature books, I believe, at this point, which is quite a few. Some of them do actually have complete texts within them and they were intended to be read. The initial part of this collection was donated by Charlotte Smith in 1996. So this book here, Book Interlude, is the first book that Charlotte and her husband Thomas made. So Charlotte started collecting miniature books when she ran out of room in her library because they took up so much less space. And that's not necessarily the reason that somebody might make a miniature book, but I think it's um, one of the reasons why somebody might collect them. You can see that we still have quite a lot of shelf space here, and that's a luxury that we don't have in most of the collection. But when these are so small, they just you can fit a lot more of them on a limited amount of shelf space. European printers began testing the limits of the size of books not long after Gutenberg created his movable type printer. Some of the earliest miniature books were used for traveling purposes or to keep in your pocket so that you would always be ready for your religious ceremonies. By the 19th century, the popularity of miniature books grew into hymnals, works of poetry, popular fiction, pop-up storybooks, and even photo albums. One of the things that I really like about this collection is that there's a great variety of stuff. It's based on his diary, so he saw everything from Oliver Cromwell's takeover to public hangings, so we have like a night in the theater. My name is Bethany Clunder, and I'm the Special Collections Cataloger for the Charlotte M. Smith Collection of Miniature Books. We have things from the 17th century all the way up to the present. Um, a lot of the things that I'm finding when cataloging are works by famous authors that are just produced in a miniature book form. They rescued this tiny little set of Shakespeare books, which was in this bookcase. Some of the miniature books in our collection don't even really look like books until you really take a serious look at them. And that's a book. That's a book. Um, well, some of them I do have to use a magnifying glass on. We have several micro miniatures. And those are books that are very, very small. For sure less than a quarter of an inch on any one side. So very tiny. And you need a microscope to read them. This one is really one of my favorites. So I think it's a great way to get people interested in reading and to get people interested in special collections and what we have here at the University of Iowa Libraries.